thrust and pressure. Have you ever wondered why a camel can run and walk in the sand easily? Why the area of wheels or tires in heavy vehicles is kept more? To understand this, we need to understand the force acting in a particular direction and the pressure developed per unit area. Let us learn about thrust and pressure. Suppose you need to fix a poster on a notice board. For this, you need to press the pin using your thumb. When you apply force on the head of the pin, the force acts perpendicularly on the sharp end of the pin and the pin gets into the cardboard easily. The force acting on an object perpendicular to its surface is called thrust. The unit of thrust is same as the unit of force that is Newton.